Good morning. We rented mini heavy equipment and truck for from my buddy. We rented this equipment to renovate the shop more. The back of the shop, there was bamboo for us. We cut it down, but there's dirt and roots still left there. So I will use this heavy equipment. It's mini version, but it's still heavy equipment. Gonna break it out and dig it, dig out the roots and make it flatten. Another shop renovation and I'm excited. Let's go. These bamboos, insanely strong. Their roots are massive. They all connect each other too. Like this. Uh, I, I got only one day. Let's do it. Good morning. It's next day. And I only filmed first hour or two of start doing it, digging. Since it started pouring rain, it was gnarly rain, and I couldn't film, and I forgot to film later on. But I finished it eight afternoon, so I was doing it over 10 hours. I was driving for 10 hours, and I was here 13 hours from seven to eight. But I got it done, and I'm stoked. I got everything I wanted to get done. If I have rented the bigger one I rented previously for my land, it was twice as bigger than the one I rented yesterday. It took me twice as longer since it's smaller. It was pretty big area and a lot of dirt to move, but I got it done and I'm stoked. And I just got here at the shop so I'll show you guys. Current shop lineup. Brought my 15s here. And here it is. I don't know if you guys can tell. I moved like five feet back about. Bamboo forest was like till here. Yeah. And moved everything over here and then we stabbed these pipes for the wall we're gonna build with this pipe and these panels it's gonna be three meter tall wall pretty good that was a lot to do bamboo roots are insane you guys probably can't tell but it is insanely strong they connect all each other like roots connect insane look guys dirt was till here i could barely park one car dirt was about here and we pushed this dirt was till this gutter pushed that much that's a lot more and i i was trying to dig back here but it was scary I hit a tiny bit right here. Glad I didn't break it. Yeah, I, I'll i clean it up today. But here's the end result. 13 hours working in this mini. Now we are getting some dirt or gravel to fill that dirt spot. Oh yeah, let's go back to the shop. We are back at the shop. Just cleaned out the ground. About to dump this gravel and cover this dirt. Just this part, but let's do it.
that flat and little better. One more dump on this low spot. What a transformation. Oh yeah, we got a lot more room. Dirt was till like this point. Yeah, we extended that much. That's like three car width, but we're gonna build a paint booth right here somehow. All right, we got everyone here and cleaning out the shop floor. Okay, garage is fully cleaned out the floor was fully dusted rusty whatever we got it off from the wall to the roof but i know it's dirty with all the paint drip i bought this shit for asphalt paint it will be all pitch black i will eventually do a concrete so i can put a lift but as for now leaving this like this and just clean it, painting the asphalt paint all over. It should be good for now. And we got Leah's 34 here. We're gonna start work on this so she can start driving in Japan. First, we're gonna do a compression test, do little stuff, manifolds cracked. So we're gonna remove this turbo and manifold and weld all these cracks. I got most of the necessary stuff from my house garage so we can finally start doing sh work on cars here brought oil to all that so uh i have to change oil on s15 today this shit's ready to go just load it up and my buddy drukas over here put in this bright low max I just found 200 yen in my car, I'm up. What's up? 200 yen? Under the seat. <laughs> oh yeah. What's up, Rukas? What's good? Are you, are you happy? Yes. Are you excited? I'm excited. I'm happy to oh, be at the new you, shop. Oh yeah, you're the first, first customer. Right. right, right. <laughs> and you're coming with us too, yeah? Tomorrow? Yep. Tomorrow. Yes, sir. What's wrong with him? He's drifting with the LMG T4. <laughs> Oh, you keep saying you? Same shit. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with them? Would you drift on this wheel if you had it? Would you? He does. All right, let's see if this will be one piece in the <laughs> <Jumps>. tomorrow. <laughs> I heard you're gonna go ham tomorrow. Oh, that's what you heard. Huh? <laughs> He's gonna put those bucket seats. Yeah, put the seat rail on the seat. Rail. Are you gonna put the? No, I think he's just gonna make sure. <laughs> Don't trip, you straight. You said don't trip, you straight. <laughs> All right, good luck, boys. I gotta go work on my car. <laughs> All right, let's pull this in the shop. First car that is going to the shop. I haven't mentioned, had a mess right here, but got the couch and table set it up. Found this in an offer up type of app, and Koji just cleaned it out, deep cleaned this couch inside out shop is getting somewhere gonna put ac tv oh yeah we got a lot a lot to plan this is just parts just stowing i'll clean it up soon She's gonna park it next to the S34. What are you guys doing? <laughs> okay, you got skills. Oh, 
お疲れ。はい。はい。I don't have a power yet, but I got extension cord from nice neighbor <laughs> and powering up one LED light. Managed to work on my car. I just changed the oil, oil filter. I got GK Tech fan on the other S15, so I removed it and put it on here. So it should be better cooling because this car was getting hot. That should be a little better. I wanted to do water spray soon. I got the pump already, I just gotta rebuild. I just gotta build the line and switches and all that. We got brown S15 on the jack stand. Well, if you watched my previous episode from when I went to Fuji, there was clunky noise. And we found out this traction rod. Look at that, blown out. Yeah, both sides. Well, maybe it look like it's bent. So we found the issue, the clunky noise. And I had this Nismo lower control arm and their stronger bushing. So might as well. Right now we got whole rear knuckle off and removed lower control arm. I'm about to just put it all back together. A four traction rod. I don't have any spare. All I had was OEM one. So here it is. Other arm is looking fine. No play. I gotta need the whole refresh on the rear end. New coils. I have a reinforced subframe. Yeah, we got everything out. Pretty dirty and rusty bolts. Let's put this. Nismo, bruh. Nismo. Nismo. Yes. Uh, even just this lower control arm and stock traction rod instead of blown out bushing pillow joint it will probably feel so much nicer i'm going fuji this weekend so can't wait to test it out with the nismo lower control arm and without clunky noise play on the rear end let's get this back together Nothing you can see, but it is way better now. Because in the video, I mounted the GoPro on the door. The view of the rear wheel, it showed my toe was changing a lot when I was driving. So that traction rod caused the toe to change, I believe. And Nismo lower arm has a stiffer, stronger, bushing so i bet i will feel that in driving so i can't wait to drive it little bit refresh in the rear end this thing gets hot too quick so i gotta figure it out and i noticed this doesn't have this what is it this ac fan like fans that turns on when you turn the ac on so i bought used one this part mounts sandwich here but i can't figure it out where the connect is so i gotta try to find it i don't think i have enough time to install a water sprayer by this weekend which is in four days i'll change this fan from oem to i have a gk tech one so i'll change this fans out should be way better oh hi oh we're in 7-eleven getting some 
food. What time is that? Little past 6 a.m. Ohio. 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 <laughs> we gotta go drift today. Nine up. 180, S13, S15. And today we are going Fuji. And also I'm trying out this Bellino Pelkia R for the front for the first time. New tire. My little brother Koji gonna drive my 180. And my buddy with S13. Last weekend I was driving with them. I hit him like three times. Here, here, here. And also wheels. Yeah, his car is getting. I think this is from my hood. We'll have fun today. Gonna go to Fuji. Drive with all the homies. Koji's driving my 180 and they know it's gonna go with Koji. You gonna learn from him? Right now it's a lunch time and I'm a, I'm doing a gender rebuild for the guy who's hosting the event right here. So his boy got me a collared tire and we got, we're just putting it on a 180. And I gotta do burnout and donut, do colored smoke tire. Do a gender reveal right here. So it'll be exciting.
to go. First time on the actual track. job today one turn drift yeah oh we're doing end of the day doing group photos everyone's here